Good afternoon, everybody. World Spa and Wellness is back again with our convention next year. We're launching this afternoon, 3rd and 4th of March in London. And I'm delighted to welcome Jean-Guy de Gabriac, our fellow co-host, inspirator, and of course, chair of the World Wellness Weekend. Good afternoon, Jean-Guy, how are you? Good afternoon, Mark. It's a pleasure joining you. And may I remind you that it's going to be our 10th anniversary working together, or for me, at least, the pleasure of serving uh, as um, co-host of your World Spine Wellness Convention. 10 years already. Wow. 10 years. What a typical marriage, Jean-Guy. All rows and no sex. So, um, <laughs> um, ladies and gentlemen, we've got, we all, we keep saying this, don't we? But I think, Jean-Guy, we have this year one of the strongest lineups of speakers. And I'm really, I'm very grateful to you and our panel of experts have helped put these people together. But it is a, a strong, strong program. And we've, we've really tried to focus on what is good for your spa and hotel business, whether you're an independent spa, smaller spa, or a huge multinational group. And also to help people in their careers and developing their careers. So for you and for your business is our motto for 24. Um, we've also got a bonus afternoon for the first time. Tell us about that, Jean-Guy. Well, that's very exciting because we've received uh, lots of comments from past delegates who come year after year. And they always mention at the end, great conference, great show. And by the way, it's, it's one of the largest in the UK, if not the largest. I remember uh, audiences of beyond 30,000 people walking the floor, over 400 uh, exhibitors. So it is definitely a moment in the year where people come in London at Excel and they see the innovations, they meet the suppliers, the vendors, the partners. But also uh, we have hundreds of people joining in the convention room where they exchange best practices, where we, we speak. But it's always been two days, Sunday, Monday. A very busy Sunday, lots of things to do, lots of things to catch on, and then rush back to the hotel, change into uh, a black tie and beautiful uh, dress, long dress, and then go to the gala nights. And then, well, yes, there is the party, there is the dancing, there is the late bus. And then at on Monday, 10 a.m., no weekend, just go, 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 we meet again, and that's when we have more um, best practices, more um, panels, interactive sessions, and people leave on the Monday and afternoon, uh, evening, a tad tired, and they sometimes challenge us, uh, you and me, Mark, saying, really, the spa and wellness convention, in the content, yes, in the products and innovations, yes, in how we walk the talk, in how we live and breathe what we see on slide, or is it death by PowerPoint? And this year, London is the destination where to enjoy wellness experiences on the Saturday afternoon and on the Monday evening after the show with partners opening their doors to delegates with special offers, irresistible offers and packages. Irie, ancient baths, award-winning in London, so close to um, uh, so close to Covent Garden. Banya, number one, uh, again, award-winning. And for those who don't know the benefits of a Russian banya, it's it's super heated and super charged uh, steam. And for those who want to dance, well, then that's salsa teca, and that's well, we salsa and have, bachata. We also have heart-hitting sessions. You've got Andrew Gibson and Lindsay madden Nadal, who are talking about the opportunities for spa and wellness professionals. Did you deliberately put those together because I believe they work together? Do you expect us to learn something or are we just gonna have a fight? What, you what's know, when, 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 they were, when they, they, they were connected on email to say, we're, we're so happy to have you on the same panel, Lindsay said, the team is back again. And that's fantastic. Um, um, as so you know, Andrew- about the the future of the industry. We're talking about also AI, high tech. We've got industry networking um, and a nice uh, cocktail reception. So, and that's a bonus afternoon for people who want to come. Absolutely. I'm particularly excited about the Mon the Sunday and Monday program. And I'll just, you know, we kick off 
with fitness and wellness. And we've got here where spa professionals can learn from the fitness side. You, you've got quite a great panel, Dave Courtine, an entrepreneur of Mosaic. Then you've got Stephanie Hollard, creative director of David Lloyd Clubs. And then you bring in the international Christoph, Christoph Anderson, from, who's a CEO of Planet Fis Fitness. That to me epitomizes this convention. UK, international, smaller businesses, entrepreneurs and big corporates all discussing the same issue. That's a, to me, that's a very strong session to kick us off with on the 10 o'clock on the Sunday. And then also got a great mixture at 11 on talking about attracting and retraining staff and the career opportunities. Michael Newcomb, boss of Four Seasons of the Spa, Simon Mac Marzer of, of Hyatt Hotels, Teresa O'Farrell, who's um British George Dorchester connection, and Erica D'Angelo, who does an awful lot of consultancy. She's a chief world wellness officer based in Italy, goes around a number of um, different spas. So again, a really strong mixture. And the idea is that there are no stupid questions. Everybody's in, in encouraged to quiz our speakers. You have plenty of room for that. Um, so that you can really get up close and personal and, and hear not just the corporate spiel, but what they really think and their and the benefit from their mistakes and their learnings in the past. You're right. And it's not just about learning uh, best practices for big or medium or small size businesses. It's about also meeting the movers and shakers of this industry. It's also for a lot of people a fantastic networking opportunity to introduce themselves, to ask questions and to ask questions about opportunities. I mean, um, Hilton, they have how many? 500 spas worldwide. Um, and uh, Amanda Almasri, the global director of wellness for Hilton is there. Uh, Marriott, that's about 450 or maybe also 500 spas. And uh, we have Susan Holbrook, the spa and wellness director US coming. We have Neil Jacobs, the CEO of Six Senses. Um, you did mention Simon from Hyatt and Michael from Four Seasons. We also have Zoe Wall coming especially from Dubai. She's the global uh, director of wellness for Kurtzner International and they're launching a new brand and they'll tell us, uh, she'll tell us all about it. Uh, we have uh, Lindsay, as you know, we have Sam Cooper coming from the States about Canyon Ranch. So I, it, the point is not come with your CV and pitch them. But it's also a networking opportunity, you know, ask questions that are relevant uh, the, and the opportunities will arise. I've also particularly like on the Monday morning, we've split up the day spa, hotel spa and resort spa. Now, on the one point, so you've got three sessions at the same time in smaller rooms. So you'll be able to the delegates will be able to ask questions in a more intimate environment. And whilst uh, there's a lot of learnings, I, I get frustrated because you, you'd what ideally want to be in all three sessions. Absolutely. But at least you can have, instead of having 300 people in the room, you, you, you'll you probably have 50 to 70. And therefore, that's a that's a more manageable for those who are a little shy to ask questions um, and, and really fully participate. And we kick that off on the Monday morning in three separate sessions going on simultaneously. You're absolutely right. We used to call it the breakfast club for the early risers on the Monday morning, the ones who come either with, with stick matches, you know, to hold their eyes or, or just the, the, the hardcore um, wellness warriors who come and have to make choices. Is it about boost your day spa operations or your hotel or your resort operations? And three um, seasoned um, uh, heads of, I mean, we have the founder of Camelot Spa in uh, South Africa, Debbie Mergen, she's come here. We have Carol Whittinger, the director of operations of Snow uh, Group, 70 spas uh, in, in Europe, in France and Europe. Nikki Brooks, flying from Australia. They have over 100 day spas. And of course, Susan Holbrook will be talking about Marriott. Carrie Turpin, brand new, uh, brand, 
she has been uh, recently appointed as uh, the, the global head for Corinthia Hotels. So it will be one of her first opportunities to speak. Daniel Kaur, Danny, uh, will be coming. He has won for two years in a row the PB Boutique Spa Award, professional beauty. Uh, and we have Zoe Wall, Sam Cooper from Can uh, Kurtzner and Canyon Ranch. And we also have Peter Weit coming from Germany, award-winning global um, uh, bad regards. So, so many opportunities to join in big rooms, in interactive sessions, in those breakfast um, breakfast club sessions on the Monday morning. No stupid questions, great opportunities to network. Uh, and uh, we will have a session about KPIs and, and working on your budget by seasoned professionals. And uh, one of them is Virginie Fliegens. She's a senior director uh, of Four Seasons at the iconic Georges V in Paris. Uh, she's gone through so many properties, but she, she will be sharing what she shares with her teams so that everyone is accountable for the numbers to reach. And Sona Le Broy will be coming, especially from Spain, uh, to talk about the wellness asset and how wellness really triggers uh, money. So, so many things, but Maybe can we speak about some of our keynotes, Mark, for a second? Yes, please do. No, um, I mean, I I want to reiterate, and I I absolutely do talk about the keynotes, but I want to reiterate that we've got what we try to do with this is have UK, European, and people from further afield, Australia, America, as you suggest, Middle East. But it's very much with a practical: what do I do? What have I learned? And what I've I put in place in my business and how I've how, how I have grown my career. It's it's what I call practical wellness, real wellness in the sense of it's not preaching, it's not glorifying, it's it's about how I can make I can come back as a delegate and put into practice some of the learnings and, and real learnings. But over so to you with the true. keynotes. So true. It's what you take out of. Yes, it will be a great experience. Yes, it will be a great opportunity to network. And yes, when we have uh, energy breaks or technical breaks and you, and you just want to, you know, to, to, to go out of the room or come back and get some fresh air, so the people who will stay in the room will be dancing. We are going to raise the roof with salsa and bachata. So it's about raising the energy in the room so that when people come back to their spa, to their operations, they have things to share. The delegates coming, showing up, will receive after the show the digital uh, the digital delegate package with all of the PDFs of the, the, um, the speakers. So there's a lot to bring back. There's a lot to share with the energy. But it's not just about the technical things. There will be so much. Bring a book, bring a pen, bring a friend, because you will have to make choices. Is it is it the trade floor uh, and and the exhibitors and the exhibitors and and the innovations that you want to see? And you want to see that. Is it um, keynotes or, or or sessions? You. It's better to come with one of your colleagues. You know, some spas run. Um, how do you say an incentive? And when people reach a certain number of uh, treatments, of, of budget uh, achieved, then the spa gives them the possibility to go and attend, which is a big, big plus for their And career. I'll interrupt you because we've made the cost truly accessible. Oh, I mean, yeah. If you're an industry supplier, like a skincare brand wanting to come, then it's, uh, the full rate is £1,750. But as a spa, beauty, wellness, hotel professional... A two-day Gallagher pass, including the the tax, is two hundred and ninety-five pounds. Now there are. This is a hugely accessible rate, given the speakers that we brought together from around the world. Um, and I'm really pleased and want to thank our sponsors and exhibitors for making that that possible, because you know, this is the most accessible con conference if you like, on the planet. And it's designed so that managers and aspiring directors can come as well as the heads of spa. Mark, with the sponsor's money, you could buy a new Tesla or you could fly business class anywhere you want. But as the managing director of professional beauty, you take the monies, the sponsor's monies, and you, you, you decrease the price to make it accessible for everyone. So the sponsor's money goes directly to the delegates not to professional beauty. And this is something, if I had a cap on, I would take my, my, my hat on and say, 
you know. Thank you. Well and I'll you. get the plug. Worldspawnwellness.com is where you should book. Worldspawnwellness.com. Um, jean guy before we close, last words, tell us, last few words, tell us about the, some of the keynotes. Yes, absolutely, because it's, it's about what you bring home, but it's also the inspiration you get. And so many times we hear people say, you know, the sky is the limit. Actually, what if the sky wasn't the limit? What if going beyond the sky, going into space was the limit? And what if you were born on an island, Antigua and Barbuda, and all you know is this island, and you look at the stars and you say, one day, maybe I'll go there. Maybe you have big dreams. Well, that person, Kisha Shahaf, will be coming, flying from um, Antigua and Barbuda. She has flown with Virgin Galactic last summer. And not only did she fly as a person, as a woman, as a wellness coach preparing for this flight, she also flew as a mother, bringing her 18-year-old daughter with her. The other speaker will, will be coming from Ukraine. Some of you have heard her on Zoom last year because she joined in March as her property had been destroyed with the first bombings in Kharkiv. She couldn't fly, she couldn't join, but she did join on Zoom. This year, she's getting a visa, she'll be in the room, and she'll tell us how she went from having two spas and an organic restaurant in Kharkiv, and then the invasion began, destroying and, and losing everything, resiliency, taking care of her team, building one back, and it's now in operations while the war is still going on, and she'll tell us that there's no obstacle we cannot overcome to continue to serve our industry, our community, and our purpose, which is... Uh, wellness for all. Tell us about last few words. What's Carol Phillips talking about? Oh, Carol. Carol is known in the US as the retail diva. Carol has been on the stage for, she's a, she's a Cidesco accredited trainer. She has uh, worked with, with the biggest brands in the US and she will be flying, especially from Los Angeles to share with us in an interactive session, high voltage, high energy if any of you has attended an ice bar conference and met her you know what i'm talking if you haven't been to the states and vegas and and been to this conference and seen um uh carol maybe she is the one reason why you should come anyway come join if there's something for you on the saturday afternoon sunday monday packed for you to bring back to your team and please do not come alone bring a colleague with you because maybe it's something you could say, Mark. Uh, last year and this year, Four Seasons will be using the, the World Spine Wellness Convention and Professional Beauty as an opportunity to bring their team from Europe together. And maybe other groups are doing this also. This is a hub, this is a place to be. So the question is, is not how much does it cost, is are you in, ready to invest in your future by simply showing up? Make the time, come with well, some. thank you. Thank you very much. I'm going to leave it here. I will see, hopefully, you 3rd and 4th of March um, with a bonus afternoon second. on the 2nd of March, yes. Saturday the 2nd. And well, worldspawnwellness.com is where to book. All the best. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, John Gee. Thank you so much, Mark. Looking forward to seeing all of you.